Hey, what is up guys? PC Lost Place here with another PC related topic. And today I'm going to be showing you how to install Metro for your Steam. So Steam skins are a very good way of organizing your Steam and making it more pleasing to the eye. So first what you want to do is open up your browser. In this case, it's Microsoft Edge. So you want to go to Metro Metro for Steam. Com. And here you're uh, shown a good website with a video that shows you what it's about and how it looks like. So press download. It's the latest version for Steam. Now once it's done, extract it to your desktop and put it into a new folder. So open that. And what you want to do is double click this install this font folder and double click this true type font file and install it by clicking install. If it's already there, just replace it and click yes. Now once it's done, you want to close out of that and go back. And now we want to open our Steam folder. So go to C drive and depending on if you have 32-bit windows or 64-bit windows, in this case I have 64-bit it will be times 86 program files then what you want to do is go to steam steam apps oh wait <laughs> excuse me skins steam like steam skins right <laughs> so then what you want to do is just drag in your metro for steam into the skins folder pretty simple now what you want to do is go into this readme file and download this copy and paste this into your browser and it will automatically download this file metro for steam settings now what you want to do is open up your metro for steam folder that's actually in the skin folder not the download folder and drag this in and if you double click it you can customize your whole metro so for me I'll do pink as my accent color and this is already selected as a friends list and you can just do a custom uh, font if you want, download it from the internet. I'll have a description, uh, link in the description below on how to install custom fonts for your computer. So just click OK when you're done. Now, here's an important part you want to do to get it working. Go to Steam, and go to View, Settings, and go to Interface. So now you'll see, you select the skin you wish Steam to use. And now you'll see Metro for Steam, or if you download any other ones, it will show you. I have one in the description below, which is a very nice one. It's called um, Air for Steam, and it's very organized and looks very pleasing to the eye, too. So click Metro for Steam, and click OK. Now what you want to do is restart Steam. Let that restart. So as you see, there's a custom logo when it's launching. It looks very nice. So now, you installed Metro. So it looks very nice. It's very organized. You have your store, library, community, and Sugoi on my profile. So here it's more organized. Here's all the list of the options and settings. It's more organized, listed by order by downloads and settings and up here you have your profile your um, friends your downloads and here's my accent color that I picked and these are your items so as you go in your library you can highlight things and you see that it's pink that's the accent color that you picked so yeah guys that's pretty much it if you want to see more steam skins go to deviantart Steam skins. Just look that up on Google. And many people are uh, making some very good Steam skins. And I recommend Air, which I, I will leave in the description. This is it. And there's also a different Metro skin, but it's beta. So, yeah, guys, thank you for watching and see you in the next PC video.